Hello, wonderful little beans. My name is B, and welcome back to another video. Before we get started, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, click that bell, and you stack up B when buying Robux or Premium. Jeez, B, is this a competition to see how fast you can do the intro? Yeah, Dolly, it is, because people keep complaining that my intros are too long. Well, I think they're fine. You should just listen to all the people that love the video. Yeah, but I could also try to talk a little bit less at the beginning, you know. You know, so we have more space to argue with each other like this. Yeah, I mean, sure. Anyway. So you guys, if you are interested, I am sure you are probably curious about the announcement for Royal High 3. As you guys know, the Royal High 3 announcement came out during the release of Dewdrop Showers when the campuses were renamed to Royal High 1, Royal High 2, and then, of course, the new score being announced as Royal High 3. I think some of you guys might not really think about it this way, but calling something that name, the way she's listed the names, is a bigger deal than you might think. Saying campus classic and then new campus and then new school is not only more confusing, but adding a number to them, you guys, making the original Royal High, Royal High 1, the current Royal High, Royal High 2, and the new Royal High, Royal High 3 is a lot more significant than you might realize. When you separate things by numbers, you make them into iterations, you guys. They're not just part of the same world. They become whole new games, whole new movies, whole new things. Like, for example, if you watch, I don't know, movies like... Harry Potter 1, Harry Potter 2. Whilst part of the same world, they are all individual movies continuing the story on for later. When you have a new game, let's say Fortnite, if Fortnite then had a Fortnite 2, it would probably be a whole new game. Minecraft 2, it would be a whole new game. That's why Fortnite and Minecraft don't make new games. Instead, they just keep updating the same one because the game itself fundamentally stays the same. The fact that Barbie obviously has Royal High 1 and Royal High 2 now, you guys know that fundamentally those schools changed a lot. There was only a few similarities and the reality is most of it did change. So by calling the new school Royal High 3, she's clearly indicating that it's essentially going to be a whole new game in itself and will totally, fundamentally change Royal High. So what should you expect? Well, you guys, I personally think that if you're expecting the new Royal High 3 and the new school campus to be the same as Royal High that we know and love now, or to even be similar, you would be mistaken. Lots of the pictures we have seen of the new school look completely, totally different to the Royal High we have now. And I really just don't feel that in any way, shape or form, this Royal High that is coming out soon is going to be the same as the one we have in game now. In fact, I think it's going to be wildly different. I think the whole new school is going to be totally changed. I think the whole fundamental systems that the game has is going to be totally changed. And I think everything that we know about Royal High right now is going to be completely renewed. I completely agree, you guys. There is no way a whole new campus that was only going to be just an extension of the current game would take two and a half years to develop. It's fairly obvious to me that this is going to be an entirely new game. Exactly, you guys. And not only that, Lance said in his live stream that Barbie isn't particularly fond of the current Royal High and wants to completely remake the game. His exact words were, that is why she is totally remaking the game. So in other words, you guys, I think it's pretty obvious that Barbie is going to be totally revamping Royal High into an entirely new, completely separate, and totally reworked game. I think that personally, you guys, it's going to be really exciting, and I am really, really excited to see exactly what she is going to be doing with this. I just don't think that anything is going to be the same. I think it's going to be a whole new game. I think it's going to be a whole new world. I think it's going to be a whole new system, and none of us are really prepared for it. Now, Little Beans, I am always interested in your opinions, so I thought this would be a good opportunity to take all of your ideas for this. With all the new badges coming out recently, with Lance's tea spills, with all of the other stuff that we know is going on with Royal High right now, I feel like it's the perfect time to ask you guys what you think is going to be happening here. So please, please let me know in the comments down below. What do you think is going to be different? What do you think the new school is going to be like? Are you excited? What do you hope for? And what do you think is going to change that you might miss about the old Royal High. I cannot tell you guys in words how excited I am for this new school, how excited I am for all these changes, and how excited I am for the future. But I know you guys will understand because I'm sure you're all feeling the same way too. 
So little beans, please let me know in the comments. Are you excited? Are you nervous? What do you feel about this whole thing? It's going to be so wildly exciting, you guys, and everything's about to change. And I just can't wait to see how the devs decide to go about all of this and what they decide to do. So little beans, I hope you will leave some comments down below letting me know your opinions because I am so excited and I can't wait to read what you guys all think as well. But on that note, you guys, I'm going to leave today's videos here. I am now finally starting to feel better, you guys. So after today, my videos should be back to normal length again. Thank you so much, everyone who supported me while I've been sick and still watched the videos, still liked them, sent love on them, everything else. I appreciate you so much and I can't wait to get back to regular streaming and stuff again with you guys. I love you all so much. I hope you have an amazing day and I'll see you all in the next video. Love you guys lots, little beans. Have a great day, everyone. Goodbye. I hope you all smell like poop. Bye.